Good morning, everyone. Hope everybody's doing well. You know me, I'm Tom, back here at the off-grid farm. Oh, yeah, on this beautiful, cool ah, morning with all the cows. There's a bunch of them now. And, of course, my chicken that I inherited. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, man. Good morning, everybody. Hope everybody's doing well. Yeah, you know, this has been one of the wildest. Uh, sorry, first off, I haven't done a video in a while, but uh, it's because of all kinds of th stuff that's been happening in my life, which has all been good stuff, let me tell you. I won't go down the list, but uh, let's just say uh, everything is positive, and, uh, you know, I'm just dealing with life and <laughs> work and, you know, just doing, you know, <laughs> all the things I have to do to maintain my shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, uh, on that note, let me tell you what I've been doing, okay? Well, what happened was, is uh, the last video I did was when I was at the lake, right, with the boat, okay? That was last weekend. Okay, well, since then, guess what? I've had some real issues with the trailer, okay? Here's what's been going on. Oh, man. Well, first off, when I was coming back from the lake, I blew these two tires. Now, remember, this this <laughs> this boat has been sitting for a long time, okay, uh, when I bought it. So, yeah. Anyway, I blew, I blew both tires at the same time. I mean, they were shredded. So, I did have a spare with me, but it wasn't that great. And... As you can tell, these are brand new tires. Both of these are brand new, okay? Now, what I had to also do is, I haven't done this yet, but this is also old, old. <laughs> and a few other things I need to replace too. Now, here's my other new tires. There's the old ones. Now they're dry rotted. You know, they look good, but they're not. They'll fall apart at any second. But I went ahead and got another one, had it mounted, and then I bought a backup spare. So what's going to happen is this one here is going to go on this side. This is already brand new, too. This is the one i got to replace. And then I'll have two spares okay two spares that's right <laughs> i got the boat covered pretty nicely and also too i stained all the wood uh which came out really really good i know it's hard to see what's going on but everything's soaking wet it rained all day yesterday here in raleigh all of north carolina but all the wood's been stained okay it looks real pretty, man. I'm telling you. I did it inside and out. So that's a that's a major improvement too. Polyurethane that. And I had some really, really good looking uh, 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 stain uh, for the wood. Uh, it's teak. So that's what, I, that's what I did. Okay. Got my little cover there. But all I can say is this boat really came out uh, great. I mean, I spent a lot of money on it, obviously. Get it fixed up and painted, you know, the valve drive on it because it was looking pretty shitty. And the only thing left that I haven't done is the, uh, the bottom paint. I haven't done that yet, but we'll get to it. Oh, God. <laughs> Nothing like being out in the country with the farm animals, right? And I mean, it rained last night, too, big time. You can see it from my uh, collection barrel. Uh, yeah, clear and full. That's the way I like it. But anyway, I bought this towing thing here. I was at Ag Supply yesterday. Went ahead and picked up this. And also to a spare tire mount bracket. So I'm going to try to do that. I definitely got to go ahead and put the tire on. Try to get this bracket on and then see what the story is with this right here. See if I, it looks like uh, only two bolts are holding. Yeah, it looks like only two bolts are holding it. And 
In fact, I need to walk over here. Everything's soaking wet. I already told you that. But I started a new job in the morning. Helping a buddy of mine out. He's got a big landscaping company. And I'm going to bring the equipment trailer because we got to rent a skid steer. And uh, we're putting down a whole bunch of uh, sod. And anyway, a lot of work. It's like 21 pallets of sod. It's going to be a big job. And we got to scrape the top of the surface, uh, you know, prep it. And then lay some backfill down, some topsoil. And then install all this sod. So... Here's all my wrenches. Yeah, there we go. All right. Man. Like I said, it's pretty cool this morning. It's like 60. It's only going to get up to like 62 degrees. But, uh, let me check. I just got up here, so, yeah, everything's cool. And, oh, yeah, another shout out. Hold on. And throw those in there. It's another shout out to everybody. Thank you very much for finally getting me to 26,000 plus subscribers on my channel. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You know, <laughs> mine's a slow growing channel, but it's been growing slowly for years. And I, and I appreciate you. I really do. You know that. Uh, it gives me a reason for doing these videos because... Not only is it just a cool thing to go back and watch some of these old videos of mine, uh, and, and it takes, you know, it takes me back when I first came here, and I did all those videos when I first started the farm, you know, uh, what, nine years ago, so I've been on YouTube a long time, and it's been a lot of fun. I appreciate all your patronage, too, but yeah, all my stuff is organized, Everything still looks good. No issues. It's great, great, great. And I'm telling you, I remember when these uh, neighbors of mine only had three. Three cows. <laughs> now they got a whole herd over here. All right, boys and girls. Right. What's going on? Yep. Did you guys have fun last night, all that, all yesterday, all that rain? Yeah. And here comes my guineas. But, farm life, man. Yeah, they're hiding over there. Farm life. Ah, some people are coming up the driveway. Yeah, what's uh, what's happening is my neighbor, they're building a 5,000 square foot house way back there on the back of their property. And they've been having some construction, some framing guys uh, coming up here basically, basically almost every day, framing this uh, house out. And uh, I went over there and looked at it. It's big, man. It's got a basement in it. Big, big house. But, you know, he's married, three kids, and they're a young couple. So this is their future home here. Oh, yeah, future home. <sighs> yeah, and this is like day 43. So I don't even, I haven't, I stopped counting how many days it's been since I quit smoking. It's been a long time. Yep. I don't feel any different. I mean, that's, that's all it boils down to. I don't feel really any different, but I'm glad I did it. I needed to. You know, as you get older... The last thing you need is a bunch of uh, incurred health problems that you did yourself. You know, you did shit to yourself. You know what I'm saying? So I had to nip that all in the butt. <laughs> all right, let me get let me get to work. I'll talk to you guys tonight. You know what to do. Time out of here on this beautiful, beautiful Sunday. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Me and the farm animals just hanging out. I'll talk to you guys tonight. Bye. You know what to do.